And as recovery efforts on the East Coast get underway, a Lafayette-based corporation is introducing a new foldable mobile emergency shelter. As News 18's Krista Henry reports, this shelter can be set up in 15 minutes, and it's equipped to be used as a temporary living space for days. And actually has, uh, has uh, roof mounted, uh, air conditioning. This 16 by 8 foot configuration may not look like much from the outside, but step inside and it's a whole lot more than what looks like just a white box. We've got cots for four people built into this that are foldable to the walls. This week, Wabash National introduced what's called the DuraPlate Foldable Mobile Shelter at the National Emergency Management Expo in Orlando. President and CEO of Wabash National, Dick Jeremini, says ironically, the mobile shelter is being introduced just as recovery efforts from Hurricane Sandy get underway. However, he says the idea for this particular mobile shelter came about several years back. We were inspired actually by Hurricane Katrina and some of the challenges that uh, the, the folks faced during that crisis. Jeremini says it can be used as a multi-purpose solution for everything from mobile offices. We have a table, chairs that people can uh, work at while they're here, read, relax. To even temporary living quarters. We have cabinets installed uh, that are available uh, so, so that uh, families have places to store their, their clothing and, and other goods. Um, and also counters to prepare meals. Uh, it's set up with a refrigerator, microwave. But he says whatever this product is used for, they're ready to start producing. We certainly are ready uh, to be able to uh, build and deploy units uh, as necessary to help support uh, those that have been, uh, le been left with, uh, without their homes for some period of time and, uh, and see if we can't step in and help. However, as of now, Jeremini says the product is not yet on the market. Krista Henry, News 18.